Hey everybody, Amy here. Welcome back to another video. I got a Dollar Tree haul for you yet again today. Yeah, I went to uh, two Dollar Trees today to make this haul for you because like I said before in other videos, I have a bigger one and I have a smaller one and the smaller one's just not putting anything new out right now, but my bigger one, they're constantly, all the time putting new ones, new stuff out new stuff out. My dog is down here and he is licking my arm and you need to stop. He'll probably jump up at some point so you might see him at some point in the video. Anyway, stop. His name is Richard, Richie for short, and he is my shadow. Okay, let's get started in this haul. So, I, some of these items are new to me. Uh, I found, oh, I showed you guys in the last video, I found some Crafter Square scrap paper, and I took, I think it was three of them, and this was the last one, and it's like, hello, I need to go with my friends, so I took the last one, and it's just paper, and like I said before, I like to craft, so I like to do like gift tags and things like that, so that's what that's going to be used for. Uh, I did get some sponges. Uh, we are putting our house up for sale. This, uh, the realtor will be here tomorrow. There he is. The realtor will be here tomorrow to take pictures and things. Uh, I have to get in the cracks of my sliding glass doors. And I'm hoping that because that these have the little cutout right there, that these will go in there. I just, I just don't know if, if I'm late to the game on this or the party on this. I don't know how to clean that all that great. I looked today at TJ Maxx for a special tool to help me with it, and I had no luck. So I got a couple bottle brushes. I got some at TJ Maxx, and I got some at the dollar store, and I got these sponges. So I'm hoping I'm able to figure out how to do that. If you have any recommendations, let me know because I just don't know. I, how do you clean that? Anyway, there are six sponges in this package. Uh, it is by Scrub Buddies for touch, for touch cleaning, tough, tough cleaning jobs. Hand shape protects nails, multi-purpose and durable. Like I said, you get six in there. So I'm sure I'll need six. Uh, I'm sure I'll, I'll tear it up. This was a bottle brush that I got. Uh, this was in the baby department. It is Angel of Mine. Not that you can't, well, you might care if you have babies. I don't have babies anymore. So uh, it says it's BPA free and it's a baby bottle brush. And I got it in the color pink because my favorite color is pink. But I'm thinking, like I said, this little part right there probably will fit in my track. So that's what I got that for. I got another bottle brush thinking that this is soft enough to squeeze down tight in there. Like I said, I'm going to give all of this a try. I'll have to show you the one I got from TJ Maxx too. And uh, this is also by Scrub Buddies. Uh, it's a dish cleaner, it says, but we're going to try it on my sliding glass door tracts too. And I have seen everybody hauling these and I finally found them. Yay! These are the Eco Tools Mask removing sponges and you get three and you got to love the little plastic bag that it comes in and they're for a quick mess-free removal made with natural cellulose to wipe away masks spa quality this is a name brand uh, product so I got two because I have two girls and they love face masks I'm constantly buying them face masks I swear they do one every night so Pick those up. I'm so excited to see that. Yay. And I need a deodorant. I got two of them. This is just the secret. The secret power powder fresh. And it's the turn style at the bottom. And it's just the white powder. I grab these every so often. And I'll grab more than one at a time. And every time I'm getting low, um, I go to my closet and they're gone. So, like I said, with my girls, I think they take them. Which is fine, I don't care. It's okay, it's okay. I don't mind. I found today, this is another new to me product at my dollar store. And this one was at the little one. 
Um, sorry, I'm out of breath. I was moving around trying to get everything ready for this video. Uh, this is the nail art, and these are the stickers. I got two packages because I, uh, I like to do uh, the... Now I can't think of what it's called. The nail stickers that they sell that you get in... Like you have to have a party and um, you can buy them at like craft shows, things like that. I like those. So this is the same idea. So I thought that I would give these a try. I've never seen those. This was the most, to me, the cutest pattern. They had geometric shapes and they had some like black and hot pink ones, which I am a big fan of black and hot pink, but I didn't like the shape that it made on the nail. So I got these, thought they were adorable. I know my other daughter will take them for sure. Speaking of my other daughter, my youngest daughter, I finally found, new to me item, the tote. The, I mean, they have these a lot. I mean, they have them all the time at Dollar Store by the Essentials. It's the collapsible storage bin, but this is in the marble print. This marble print right now is very popular. My, uh, my daughter, both of them actually like the marble print. She just wanted these for her new closet that we're gonna have for her. She has the water bottle and she has a cell phone case all in this marble print. So she was excited to hear that I have found it. I have seen other people haul it. So she was excited because I told her it existed. Another new to me product, Elizabeth Taylor. Yes. Now I've shown you, I've gotten Lucy movies. Uh, and the one was a double feature because it Lucy on one side and Betty White on the other. This one, again, Elizabeth Taylor. This is Echo Bridge Entertainment. And I think this is two movies. I think Life with Father and Father's Little Dividend. Again, this is another Walmart movie, probably from the $5 bin. And... It says 1951, 82 minutes, black and white, not rated. I am excited for this. Yay, that was another good find for me. And I found these are going to be, I can't talk today. I'm going to give these to my mom. She likes to do puzzles every now and then. But these, I don't know if you've seen them. I haven't seen anybody haul them. I don't know if they're new. But they're cereal, and there's only 50 pieces, but there's four puzzles here. So I figured this will keep her busy long enough. She'll enjoy it. Not too hard, not too many pieces to keep her really committed for a while. But uh, I thought it was cute. The Kellogg's Rice Krispies and the Apple Jacks Frosted Flakes and Fruit Loops. And like I said before, each, pick, each puzzle is 50 pieces, and it's 5 by 7 in size when you get it finished. Does it say, oh, this is a Greenbrier product distributed by Greenbrier International. So you should be able to find these at your dollar store. Like I said, I don't know if those are new or if I'm very late. And then speaking of puzzles, I got her another puzzle. This one's bigger. This one's a 500 piece, but this one is coffee. Her kitchen is all coffee. So she will enjoy this one. Maybe she'll glue it together and hang it in her kitchen. So I know that puzzles are hard to find lately, especially that size. They're going so quick off the shelving. So um, to me, this is another new product. I found some good stuff today at the big one. Uh, another new product for me, they were putting these out on the little display, like our Dollar Tree has a round display case and it's got like little knick-knacky things all over it. This was their new blue sign. And it says, lead with love. I love the color blue. It's got the little heart in it. You can see it's off, up off the frame. It's got the wood looking paper behind it. This is a Greenbrier product. Uh, it says four of 2019 MDF. So, and it's got the little tag on the back so you can hang it on the nail. I just, I think this will be so cute sitting on a little coffee table or next to a candle or something. So when we move, I'll put that out. It'll be adorable. And I got my daughter, my youngest, is addicted to popcorn. I got her two, let me see if I find the other one. I know I got it here somewhere. I got her two boxes. 
of the kettle corn. She likes kettle corn. She's the only one really in the family that likes the kettle corn. And you get three bags in a package. I finally found, new to my dollar store, the Texas Toast Croutons. Everybody's been hauling these too. I grabbed two bags because when you see them, you got to grab them or they will be gone the next time you go. You can go back later in the afternoon and they will be gone. Uh, this is a five ounce bag of New York Bakery Original Texas Toast Garlic and Butter flavor. They did have another flavor. I think it was just seasoned, but we prefer the garlic and butter flavor over just the seasoned. So I got those. And then another new to me product. And these were almost gone already. I and It's probably new to me because I'm not a big tea drinker. So I kind of skip over that little section. I usually just grab the instant coffee for my crafts for staining fabrics and lace and things. But they had the uh, tea. This one is blueberry and honey. And like I said, it was almost gone. So I snatched two boxes just in case I did like them. I know they have a chamomile. And I'm not sure what the other flavor is. Maybe a green tea. I have grabbed, grabbed them before. One box. I, I'm not a big tea drinker. But I'm hoping I like this one. And this is... Let's see, 20 tea bags in a box. And it's, it is a, uh, let's see, imported and distributed by McLean Global. And it's coming out of Houston, Texas. Packed in Sri Lanka. I'm not even going to butcher the name of that tea. I, I, I'm pretty sure it's a, well, I don't know. Is it a big name tea? I don't, I thought I've seen that as a big name tea. I don't know. Tell me below. Is it a big name? I don't know. A brand name? I don't know. I do know that they have um, other flavors. Okay. Not seen these either. And I've seen them hauled. Uh, I know my neighbor, she found, you know what? I have seen it, but it wasn't at my dollar store. It was uh, the one that's 35 minutes north because I was with my neighbor up there. And she found them and she got them and she tried them and she loved them. I did not get any, but they are the Oreo brownie cream filled. Yay. They are, it is one brownie and it's three ounces. And let me tell you, this brownie is heavy. It is heavy. So I got two of them so I can try it because I, like I said, I've not seen them at my dollar store. And I'm going to show you, can you see that? Can you see that? Probably not, huh? I'm not going to read it. It's an Oreo brownie. It's not gonna be pretty. And I got two of them <laughs> and I'm gonna eat them. Not in the same day, but I'll eat them. Maybe, maybe I'll share, maybe I'll share, cut it in half with my husband one. We'll see. And speaking of husband, I got him two Father's Day cards for my girls. And I just picked two up and I'll let them pick which one they want. This one says, Happy Father's Day. You're really, you've really been good to our family. And then it says, with working hands and a caring heart, you've brought so much joy to our family. And if anyone deserves a happy Father's Day, it's you. I know which daughter's going to pick that one. <laughs> because my other one, my oldest, will go for this one. <laughs> She'll pick this one. Dad, we wanted to get you an all-expense-paid trip to somewhere tropical par to a tropical paradise for Father's Day. And it says, but on our budget, this card was all we could afford. <laughs> She'll pick that one. My oldest will pick that. I know she will. She, she's funny like that. She'll pick that one. Got myself a basket. Cute little basket with the white handles and the little holes on it. This is... Okay, <laughs> I don't know why I can't read that today. It is uh, Greenbrier International. <laughs> I'm having a hard time with this video. I'm sorry, I apologize. And then I finally, I've been waiting and waiting and waiting for these to come out. I have them, usually I see them every time I go. 
But uh, the one time that I specifically need them for a craft, I can't find them. I have been waiting for a couple weeks for these. So the thought process on this craft, I don't know if you follow the shabby tree or not. Uh, she is out of Georgia. I love her. I love her crafts that she does. She took one of these and put one of these on top like this. And then she stuck them together so they sit like this. And then, I can't hold it and talk. She snipped this wire part and then pushed it down. Well, it made like a woman's form. Made a woman's form. <laughs> I don't know how to put that nicely. Made a woman's form and then she wrapped it in lace and put some pretty decorations in it. But I have some antique hairpins that I think that I would like to stick like in the waistline around the woman's form. So you're gonna have to check her out, the shabby tree. Check her out, try it, give it a try and check out that video because it's a really cool video. Again, I got another not pretty item. We, I got the nacho cheese, the na nacho cheese dip. Again, I'm not going to read the label to you. You know it's not any good for you. And you know my girls and I and probably my husband will eat it. I went to Costco not that long ago. And I get the really big bags of the tortilla strips. And they're, they're like this wide by like this long. Perfect for dipping. But I got two bags. We already went through one bag. But they're, oh, they're addicting those darn chips. They're so good. Another new to me item. Look at these stickers. Do you see that? It's like in a mason jar with the little candy, like the suckers. I want to open this up because it says a 3D sticker bag, which these were one of those items that's right by the register that they get you to purchase while you're standing there waiting. How could you pass these up? These are really cool. Look at that. Is this a Greenbrier product? It is a Greenbrier product. Okay. Do you see that? I don't know if you get in or you can get into this. Oh, how cool is that? Look, maybe, <laughs> maybe. Yes, you can open it up. Look at how stinking cute that is. Let's see, oh my goodness. These are like heavy duty. Where's my camera at there? Can you see that? It says candy on there. These are like heavy duty plastic and the little sucker and then it comes like in a green candy. How cute is that little bag for all those little stickers and then it seals up. And there's little heart suckers. I love that. And it seals up. Too cute. Let me know if this is new. Have you seen these before? I've never seen them before. Ever. And let's see. A couple more things and then we're done. Appreciate you sticking around here. 20 minute video is a huge haul today. And let's see. Oh, uh, Thrifty, not how to say, Thrifty Diva, Theoni. Uh, I got two silicone mats from their kitchen, like the folders. I got two, I've gotten these before, but I got them for my glue gun to set down, like put my glue gun on so it catches the little drippies. I never, ever, ever, ever thought about putting my curling iron on them or my hair straightener. So I got these for my girls and that will keep my counters safe in the bathroom. Crafter Square paintbrushes. Can't go wrong with a dollar for three paintbrushes. And let's see, these were also up by the register. And... Um, they're the sanitizers. Look. <laughs> now, the small dollar store, I would, there was no limit. The big dollar store, I was limited to one. So I got uh, this one. I know it told me because I looked at them all. This one is antibacterial hand gel. This is pineapple paradise scented, and it's got the little sloth. And then the little heart. This one is sweet pea scented. And this little one here is tropical. Let's see how I have my glasses on. Tropical. 
I think that says berries scented. That's sad that I can't read that. This one with the cat is black cherry scented. Oh, and that's identical one. I tried to get all different ones. And this one was tropical again. I think that says berries on there. But you can't go wrong with these either. Hanging them from your purse or in your car. Awesome. Last last item. Um, believe it or not, I was walking into the store and they were putting out their fall decorations today in my large dollar store. You believe that? And the fall decorations today I about died. I'm like, it's not even July. We just got out of quarantine. How can it be fall decor already? <laughs> anyway, again, I wasn't going to grab them. I wasn't. And I walked through half of the store and I said, you know what? If I don't grab these, I'll be mad at myself. And she's like, oh, don't worry. We've got a whole truck of fall decor to put out. Yeah, you'll be fine. You have plenty of time this year. You don't get it. You won't get it if you don't get it when you see them. And she was putting them out. So I had the choice of every single floral arrangement that she was putting out. I got the two different versions of, are they daisies? The Gerber daisies? Oh, one is a Gerber daisy. This is a sunflower. This one is the sunflower. And it's like the khaki nude. But if you look at the petals, it's burlap. And it's got the little sunflower center. So I got the sunflowers and I got the Gerber daisies. And again, it's it's like the nude cream with the burlap, the burlap center. How cute are those? That'll go with anything. And I'm a fool for like the burlap stuff. So I got myself a bouquet. So I can mix them up and put them in a glass vase that I got from the dollar store and put it on display when fall gets here. Not yet. No, we're not rushing the season. And while, I, while I'm doing this video real quick, I want to show you the other brush that I got for cleaning these cracks. Look at this one. This was, this was not from the dollar store. This is totally TJ Maxx. But this one... Can you see that? I have high hopes for this one too, and it's kind of flexible, so I'm hoping that fits in the tracks of my siding glass doors so we can get this house on the market and get on with our summer and not do this all summer long. Because right now, I have been emptying this house because when you sell it, you gotta empty it out, and it's bigger pain in the hiney than I thought it was gonna be, but hey, it is what it is. It is what it is, it's okay. So I want to thank you for joining me for another video today, 22 minutes long. <laughs> you stuck around for the whole thing. Gold star for you today. Congratulations. You get a prize. No, I don't have any prizes yet. I haven't started. I'm not that big yet to start giving giveaways and stuff like some of the bigger Dollar, Dollar Tree Hall people are. So thanks again for watching. And I'm glad you enjoyed my video. Give it a thumbs up. Give me a comment. And I will catch you in the next one.